Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, or if you are new here, hello! So in this video I am going to be doing a Siri Picks My Halloween makeup, essentially to a certain degree because there are certain things as far as Halloween that I don't have. Anything that relies around, you know, face paint or just genuine makeup tools, maybe even, even clothing and wigs, I can definitely branch out to that for anything prosthetic. <laughs> Bit stuck with that one, so it is about... 2.53 in the morning. This time, this video is actually supposed to be the DC Comics Harley Quinn video, but I decided to give myself a little bit of a nap um, for about the 2 o'clock point. And it is my like final 10 minute nap. I woke up at 3.59. That did not help me at all. I'm trying this again, and this time we're going to get a bit further. So, Siri is going to be picking my makeup. Let's get started. Siri, what is the scariest movie out there? Here are some horror movies. Yes, I do have my um set to Australian. I, th I thought that I had it set to English. The Marshes, never heard of it. The First Purge, the advertisement. Hereditary, I have seen that one. The very, 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 very ending, and I don't want to give away too many spoilers, obviously. Although I think like more than half the world has seen it by now. But the very ending, where the young boy is in the treehouse, that literally made no sense. Like the rest of the movie was absolutely amazing. Quiet Place, cool, I have seen that. Rude, he's out there. The Cured, I have seen The Cured, um, with Ellen Page in it. Patient Zero. There was an upgraded version of that with Nungle Dorma and Stanley Tucci and Matt Smith in it. The Nun, Cold Skin, Marrow Bone, City is the Last Key, Strangers, Pray at Night, Get Out, The Nightman, I'm still yet to watch that. Jigsaw, Chester, and Flatliners. Oh, so many good ones, goddammit. Over Flatliners. My well, more of drawings, the first thing that comes to me is, um, the colours. We'll just take a screenshot. Yeah, so the colours is like, obviously the whole thumbnail is dark. The drawing is, the first thing that comes to me is, um, the colours. So we'll just take a screenshot. Okay, so the colours is like, obviously the whole thumbnail is dark. With the title in the middle of it. The, the most outstanding part of the thumbnail, the... Um, poster. Wow. Is obviously the um, Monish Rainbow Colours. So, that's what I'm going to be doing. So, I'm with my face with some neon rainbow colours. Somehow scored black paint on myself. I was locking away a jar. Okay, so let's start off with these neonish tones. Ah, so I'm going to pin my hair back. I was about to say pin my headband back. That makes no sense. Open up. So should I go in with actual colours or paints? You can also those because you don't have um, many body paints. And uh, body paint just gets way too messy anyway. There is a neon yellow. Um, I'm just going to put these colours across on my eyes. Not all over my face. That's essentially what I was gonna be thinking because of the colours on their face by editing. Alright, so I'm just going to start off with yellow. It is start from... Some gloss. I don't even put them on my face. Is that where the colors are presenting? Just going to place them down as is. I got this palette from eBay and its colors. I mean, the grey dagger takes a fair bit to pick up, but the rest of the colors work so amazing. I may as well have gotten it from the Kat Von D store. Alright, now for green, so I'm going to have to mix some white with the green because it's obviously more of a neon green and not the forest green that it represents. I'm going to place that here. Unless I am doing like a neon rainbow eye, just a Halloween version. I'm kind of surprised it didn't pop up with um, the Exorcist because when Mikey did her Alexa picks her Halloween makeup, Exorcist came up specifically because Alexa knows that Mikey loves Exorcist. A little green on there. That greenish yellow. Now for white. Rapid taking skull and in the corner. For the pink, which is it's like a peachy reddish tone pink. So I should go with a different palette then. Taking Jeffree Star's Beauty Killer palette, which was already out from when I did do my Harley Quinn look, the second one, obviously. 
take some of star power because that is perfect for this one. I was just starting to talk about a really good movie, I just watched it and typical I sidetracked myself. We just got done watching I Still See You, Earl Thorne and Richard Harmon. It's a really 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 good movie. Like it gives you your fantasy fix, it gives you your post-apocalyptic fix, it gives you your supernatural fix. It was really good. Just before that I watched Bokeh. If I'm butchering that, I think it is like a legitimate place in Iceland. But at the same time it could just be the title of a movie. Just make sure that these colours are rather opaque. Because whenever I play with Iceland, I look back on my videos and I think I could have made those colours a little bit more obvious. Just making sure it's nice and obvious in the crease as well. Because when I looked at my eyes, the eyeshadow tends to disappear. I also just watched um, the, the, night, uh, the night I was supposed to do this video. A Star is Born with Bradley Cooper and Lady Gaga and that was, I got stuck with a camcorder version but it was still really good quality. That was a really really good movie. At least it wasn't musical because I personally can't stand musicals, that's just my opinion. If you love a good musical though, then that movie is for you. Last one, it's like a deeper blue, like a green blue. So obviously you're going to take gloom and doom and gloom together. Obviously, that would be. I got one of semblance, it's almost stuck in my head. So everything is seamless now. And I don't know if I should repeat the colours on the bottom or not. I know it looks super weird without any eyebrows right now. But you know what, I'm just going to repeat the colours on the bottom. The excess powder right in the eye. Okay, it's actually looking a lot more balanced out, but I chose, but I chose to do that. What else can I ask it? <laughs> what is the scariest YouTube video? Here are some videos of scariest I found on the web. It's didn't quite pick up my um the what is the scariest so I just edited that. Here are some videos of the scariest I found on the web. There is one at the bottom here showing um two people looking freaked out in a red turn lighting. The scariest place on earth. Roman when the volume goes away. Roman at web blogs. It's got 4 million views. Yeah. Oh no, the video itself is mute. To our little home, we are here. Who's birthday? No, it's not. So this isn't really scary. Just a man, probably like a theme park actor, uh, raging as part, of, as part of his character. But for the most part, the thumbnail was a lot of reds. She kind of looks on that angle. I'll take a screenshot again. On that angle, she kind of looks a little bit like Addison Timlin. I am just saying. Right, so since there's a lot of reds there, it's the palette I'm looking for here. It's like a bright orange red. I'm gonna take this shade here, followed by the actual red shade. Mix it both. I do my eyeliner with that. Oh, I forgot I had like a series of black on that left. Try that again. Okay, I'll do the eye quickly off camera. Siri, what is the scariest game ever played? Oh, I'm not sure. Helps no one. Siri, what is a scary game? Here's some information. Oh, can you finish that? It's a scary game. Here's what I found on the web. What is a scary game? Let's try. What is a scary? I don't really know. It's supposed to be a smart computer. Siri, what? Rude. Siri, what does a Ouija board look like? Here's what I found. Uh, so I clicked on the little Wikipedia app that's at the bottom of it. I was hoping there would be a picture. Obviously, I know what a Ouija board looks like, but... I need me the colour! Alright, with it, face, if we start with if we have one. Um, pumpkin spice, sweat, pumpkin pie, I meant not pumpkin spice, close enough there. There is also checkmate. I oh, know, I'll go with a bit of both. Checkmate, here we go, finally. Okay, so... Uh, pumpkin pie is going to go on the outer edge and check that will go on the inner. Okay, when pumpkin, uh, 
and checkmate is brought out then uh, pumpkin pie. Stick her over pumpkin pie again. These fries over to the lip. Siri, what damn it? What is the scariest horror movie? What, oh, what is the scariest uh, horror movie? What is the scariest sci-fi movie? There are some sci-fi horror movies. Double Skin, Upgrade, Alien Covenant, Sweat Honors, The Endless, Void, The Cure, The Girl with All the Gifts, Life, Azorish Child, Science Fiction 41, Living on Banger, Snap Nero, Keep Busy 2, Recall, Bite, and Skyline. The Boy, Alien, Rain of Man, Anti Meta, The Triangle, Shot Night of the Fourth Awakens. This thing is giving me a headache. Um, let's go with the Endless, mostly because of the skin tones, so that I can get some foundation up on here. I'm going to be using uh, Rimmel in. Where is the shade? 100 Ivory and of course my Exo Beauty Pretty Bunda. Theory, what does a... Oh. Right, here's what I got. What... it... what... does... Uh, that's not what I wanted either. What does a post-apocalyptic world look like? Yeah, the picture that I'm seeing is cream tones with a lot of blues. So I'm going to focus on those cream tones and set my face. Pretty sure a bit of powder just launched into my mouth, so I'm going to go get a drink. What does Donald Trump. You're a matches for troll. <laughs> I'm a troll. I'm taking a dip, but what does Trump look like? What I got. So far I haven't said anything about him potentially being a devil, but mostly I just needed a bronzer. And technically I'm not scared of the guy, but he is scary. Not even American. Still looking like I am, um, I mean, all respects go to them, but I'm still looking like a drug queen. What does the Midnight Man, ah, oh, son of a, what does the Midnight Man look like? Okay. I found this. Doesn't have it all. What does Slender Man look like? Here's some information. Be grey toned. So, to dive into the Pathogos Palace and finally frame this face of mine. King Summer of Dagger from Pathogos. Like I said, you had to build it up a few times before it starts getting opaque. Siri, what is your favourite movie? Well, apparently I didn't want to work, but I'm still on YouTube. Siri, what is your favourite movie? I don't watch a lot of movies, Shannon. And the reason why I was on YouTube is so that I could browse through Mikey's uh, Alexa video so that I could get some ideas for some questions. What is your favourite scary movie? I don't really have a favourite, but I hear that 2001 Space Odyssey got some good reviews. Cool. What is Space Odyssey? Here's some information. I hope I've got a bit of an image. Here's Space Odyssey. Okay, there is reds, there is whites, there is blacks. Up for the blacks, I'm going to branch out first so that you can see the image I am talking about. Turn a little bit out of focus. First things first, curl the lashes. Second thing second, talk in a bit of a Texas accent. I could probably do a pretty good American accent, I don't know. Any Americans watching this, please do tell me if I'm sounding like a pretty good American. Something right away. Usually America, uh, Australians don't really do that good of American accents and sometimes it's even worse the other way around. Especially when an American tries to do an Australian accent. For the mascara, I'm going to take Lash Sensational. Okay, for some lashes. Actually, I have got my Rebels over on my windowsill. 
don't ask. As I sleep and sort of shuffle my pillows around, the very top of the pillow must have somehow collected these lashes and then they just stuck there for quite a while. I finally managed to pry them off the pillow and then finally managed to pry them off themselves. They look just a little less bit demented. I'm going to have to go with a different pair. Still focus on the party stack. I'm going to probably take the second last one, which is the Brave. These are very, very sticky and tacky, but I don't know if I stick to my eyes. Really. No, did not think so. I mean, it sticks to my finger like no tomorrow, but not quite my eye straight away. Probably says the 4 in the morning. I'll we'll definitely pass the 3 a.m. mark. Alright, I will be back when my lashes are on. Siri, what is a scary thriller? I must have been pressing the home button probably. Siri, what is a scary thriller? Here's what I found on the web for what is a scary thriller. Siri, what is the scariest thriller? Here is some thriller horror pigs. Past Parish, Adventure, Quiet Place, Winchester, He's Out There, Patients in Very 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 Unseen. Unseen's actually really good. Did you use the last key, Train This Parent Night? Happy Death Day. It's actually pretty good. I mean, the website, I was watching it off. Every single time I paused, I would have to re refresh the whole website just to watch it continuously. But we need some art going on here because I'm looking like a horrific clown. No pun intended. Split. That was a good. That was a good thriller. I can't speak English. Split. Mostly for the um, last shards. So I'm going to take. Oh, my hair is gone here. I put this headband back on. Even though my hair has been saying put. I'm going to take probably the brush in there. That's very helpful. It's a black, but probably a grey from Pastel Gloss Palette. As you can see, I'm very well organised. Taking this grey dagger again and. I just start along my face. His glass shards are pretty much straight. So I'm still watching back his video just to get some question ideas. Questionably ideas. I'm trying I'm failing visual beaver jokes. I'm just gonna go in random lines that follow specific um the specific lines in the thumbnail, poster, whatever. And these glass shards can match my eyebrows. Pretty sure there is a new one coming out. Glass was actually um, one of the characters' surnames, but it's still got um, James McAvoy's character in it, and the guy with the specific personality. And these glass shards are pretty much straight. And yes, I'm still watching back his video just to get some question ideas. Questionably ideas. I'm trying, and I'm failing visual beaver jokes. So I'm just gonna go in random lines. I'm gonna follow specific, um, the specific lines in the thumbnail, poster, whatever. And these glass shards can match my eyebrows. I'm pretty sure there is a new one coming out. Glass was actually um, one of the characters' surnames, but it's still got um, James McAvoy's character in it, and the guy with the split personality. To say a split personality is an um, understatement. as well. It's pretty much go everywhere. Okay, I've got some glass cracks even if it doesn't look specifically like a glass crack. What is a scary murderous movie? Sorry, I can't search that, but I can search by title, actors, year, and categories like romantic comedies or sci-fi. What is a scary sci-fi movie? Here are some sci-fi horror movies. Bite. <laughs> and the tagline, this may sting a little. It's got something to do with spiders. Obviously, they bite. Alright, that's the reason why I was asking for something that like that because the... I don't know if I just took a screenshot or not. I'll obviously figure out the halfway in the end if I did. The thumbnail, poster. I keep saying thumbnail. Poster is red toned and obviously there's like blood falling off whenever she's eating. Ooh. Spilled it again. A little bit of water. Or oh, sends a root palette. Or oh, what's less messy. And I'll just use this. A little bit of water. Kind of like now. A little bit of water. Well, it just seemed to have disappeared. That's better. I should turn as black as pigmented as shit. Probably took over my bed. The reason why I was asking for wanting some bloody looks is because. 
paws. What on earth gets false cuts? It doesn't bleed out a little bit. That's the rest of the look over. So we've got some glass cuts, got some bloody face going on. What do monsters look like? Here's some information. Doesn't help at all. What is a scary fantasy movie? Here are some fantasy horror movies. Well, technically my question came out of fantasy, but I'm glad she's still got what I meant. So just when I was searching up monsters, a movie comes out called The Monster. Uh, it's just my cupboard door. Oh, I thought there was something in my ceiling. Tiny little tiles. What's a good fantasy movie? Critics say these are some of the best. Oh, Shape of Water was a really good movie. I Caught Giants was also pretty good too. That uh, was a really good movie. Over that hit on that note. On that note, it's the exact same. It took me a lot of fun when I'm looking for though. Oh. Yep, so I had to get very, very extra with the contacts. I <laughs> also did have to redo my under eyes because putting the contacts was not the you know, slur lenses, wasn't the was easiest, and the uh, blue was just running everywhere. So, let's see if we can't do anything else. I'm just going to re browse um, the rest of Mikey's video. So now she's got some pretty good questions to ask, and I, feel like, I mean, I'll follow most of it, but can't really think of a damn thing from here onwards. So I'll be right back. What is a scary demonic creature? Here's what I found on the web for what is a scary demonic creature. Not I asked. Scary, not scary. And not demonic. Demonic. Here's what I found on the web for what is a scary demonic creature. Nothing just about, nothing about stories, literally. What does a demon look like? Okay. I found these. Cool. I don't know what I'm asking to see right now. But, but black. Okay. Stupid question coming up. What does a ghost look like? Alright. Here's what I got. Think about white. But that ops for the week. I'm going to have to give her a brush out and I'll be back. Okay, we have got how to get this light um, wig from like, the box if you're wondering. And this is, and the wig is of course ghostly, white. This is my whole entire Siri does, Siri picks my Halloween makeup, you know, just for fun. Obviously we're not right on Halloween, duh. So yes. <laughs> Hey, this is the whole entire look. Siri picks my Halloween makeup as far as the lamb and the glue goes. I just ran with all strands put right into my face. So thank you all so much for watching this video. I really do hope you enjoyed it and I shall see you all in my future videos. Bye! -bye.